some kind of more classic makeup than I usually do. I've already put my foundation and concealer and powder and stuff on and what I used will be listed in the description below, as always. And any background noises has to do with cats. <laughs> so, bring it right up in here. And I'm using my Hard Candy Eyeshadow Primer. You know, that's become a favorite of mine. I like it actually maybe more than the Urban Decay Primer Potion, to be honest. I think, though, that if you have, like, really oily, this might not be the one for you. So... Might not be the one that you want to use if you have like really oily eyelids. I don't really. So. So. There's that. And then I'm going to go in with my Elements of Surprise palette. I'm just going to use a fluffy brush and I'm not going to do that much today because I'm trying to be more classic and understated just a little bit. So I'm going to go in with this color here. And we're just going to kind of Fluff it about. It is a little darker than I remember it, but that's okay. into that crease or maybe a little bit above it and I can already see that this side needs a little bit more so by the time you see this I should have already had my surgery but I'm filming now so that there will be videos still scheduled going up even after I've had my surgery. Because I want you guys to still get some nice videos. Okay, so we've got that. And then we are just going to take... This brush here, this is a Vasante brush, and we're just going to go into this color here. So no shimmers today, I'm making things really matte. Yes, we are. And not a lot either. I know I usually use like three or four eyeshadows or more, but I want this to be like really basic. So that's really all I'm using out of there. And the next thing I'm going to do, and I'm not that great at this yet either, this is the vamp stamp. And yeah, I'm still not perfect at this, so I don't know how it's gonna go. And actually, I think it may have dried out yeah, it dried out, so we won't be using that. We will not be using the van stamp. Because this shit dried out already. Okay. 
Well, that sucks. I don't think I've even had it that long. That is incredibly disappointing. I guess we'll go with the Am Cosmetics liquid eyeliner pen. Let's see how that goes. I don't know. I haven't used one in a while. As you can see, I'm already kind of screwing it up. <laughs> okay, this is the side I have the hardest time with, though, as most of you know. If you're a regular watcher, I have trouble seeing out of my other eye. So. This side tends to be kind of funky. Yeah. So. <laughs> Trying to fix it as best I can. Yeah, it's a little funky on that side. <laughs> try doing it over here I think that's slightly better um, it's a little thicker on this side than on that side but and then I'm just gonna do a little little upturn there Sorry about my heavy breathing. And there. Give it just a little tiny bit of a wing. It's really hard for me to do like a classic wing because of the way my eyes are shaped. So, I don't think that's too bad. This could have been a little bit longer, I think. Maybe. No, I'm probably going to screw it up. Because you know that's when you screw it up. Is when you're like, oh, that could be a little longer. Right? <laughs> it still looks like it should be longer to me. Okay, that's... I'm not going to mess with it anymore. So there's that. And then I'm going to use this mascara. <laughs> that I got, I think, in my FC bag. It's the uh, E Ico um, London Lash Alert Mascara. And I've actually really come to like this one quite a bit. Uh, I got. I'm really not having the best of days with it, am I? I wash my face and everything too, but I still see like a little bit of eye crud. You know, from the Sandman. And I don't know why it's there. I feel like my skin is just really off, too, for some reason. <sighs> well, we can't always be perfect all the time, can we? So, there's that. Now I'm going to go in with some blush. No bronzer today. Just a bit of blush. Bra bit of blush and I'm gonna use the elf blush palette and I'm gonna use actually this one I usually use this one the one I've hit pan on but I'm gonna use the one below it today you can see it's kind of falling apart but it is like my favorite blush palette I 
I always smile when putting on blush. I know some people think they're, they're like, but I like to get more on the apples than most people do. Um, maybe it's my old fashioned makeup fuse. I don't know. I don't even know what that means. I don't even know what I'm talking about. I'm just crazy. So, I'm gonna go for highlighter. I don't really want to go too crazy. So I'm gonna go with that glow though from Trust Fun Beauty. And what I do is I just kind of dot it. And then I just sort of rub it in like that. I feel like nothing got properly blended today. I don't know what's up with that. And my bags are my eyes aren't that great today either. What is going on? I know I'm like complaining. It's just, I'm like, what? Something's up with me. Um, and, you know, usually I do this first. I'm actually going to do it after today. And I'm going to use the Hard Candy Brighten. Shake that up. So nice. And oh, I should leave that out. I want to leave stuff out so that I can write it down and tell you guys exactly what I used. Okay. And then, lastly, we want to go with a really nice red lip. She looks better now with my glasses on. I think when my glasses are off, I just think everything looks horrible. So. I can't even seem to put my lipstick on right. See, you get like that red, red lip. It's very classic. And now I'm gonna put on the dress that I got and show you guys how cute I look. <laughs> See you in a minute. 